Hello dear Aquarius, Sun, Moon and Rising and welcome for your June readings with me. If you're new to my channel, please do subscribe. Let's see what's in store for Aquarius, Sun, Moon and Rising for the first half of June. Well, the first week, my dear Aquarians, you are dealing with a feminine energy. Either it is you if you're an Aquarian lady, full of love, full of that sentiment of giving for doing for others. Otherwise, it is a, an, a female, sorry, a feminine energy that you are dealing with, my dear Aquarians, in the first week. It can be a new colleague. It can be a potential partner for some of you. It can be your daughter. It can be you, as I said, my dear Aquarian ladies. It can be a mother figure also that you're dealing with. It can be a person uh, at work who is helping you out. Uh, for the Aquarian students, it can be a new teacher uh, that you are getting acquainted to. Uh, and this teacher is very loving, very caring, very kind kind of a personality, my dear Aquarians. And I also see um, that in the first week, Aquarians uh, who have been, um, you know, single for a long time, might meet somebody who is a potential partner, a potential life partner for them is what I see also. I also see my dear Aquarians is that uh, for the Aquarian ladies especially is that you need to get connected to that power inside of you, that feminine power inside of you. Most probably you have lost in touch with your uh, beautiful, kind, uh, generous nature of yours that is inside of you. You need to express it more is what uh, this energy is all about also, my dear Aquarians. And I also see that for some of you, it will be to spend time with your mother or your mother is no, ne going to need some kind of attention and care in the first week of June is what I see, my dear Aquarians, for you. Then we go to the second week. Now, the second week, my dear Aquarians, is all about being creative. You need to be creative in your approaches towards life. How are you handling life's problems? Are you handling them from the same place that they originated with the same set of mind, you know? Now, your mindset has to change and the solution will also change because if you keep on doing what you have done, you will keep on getting what you have gotten. Okay, so you have to now become more creative in your approach when it comes to your life, in the way you're dealing with your life, in the way you are, um, I can say, the way you have been dealing with situation, with problems, with your own self. Okay, so you need to change that now. This is what God's energy is telling you, my dear Aquarians. And also I see that there will be a lot and a lot of work for you in the second week of June. For some of you, it can also be um, undergoing a minor surgery. Also, it can be for your tooth or for, for your knee, for example, or, you know, a minor surgery. Also, some of the Aquarians might uh, undergo in the second week uh, is what I see. I also would like to tell you, my dear Aquarians, is that please be careful when it comes to sharp objects, okay? Because getting hurt um, due to some kind of sharp tools, sharp objects is very high in the second week. I also see money is going to come in well thanks to your working, uh, the intellectual way of working also. This is what I see. And the cards are saying, my dear Aquarians, is that you need to be very creative at this point of time. Uh, whatever you do, add your originality that, you know, underline it with your originality, uh, my dear Aquarians. For the Aquarian students also, be more creative, be more original in your ideas and go and, you know, uh, surprise others and surprise yourself also like, wow, I could do this, right, my dear Aquarians? So thank you for listening. I'm going to see you in the next week of uh, sorry, next half of June. <laughs> Until then, take good care of yourself. Bye-bye. God bless. Bye.